Welcome everyone. It is February 2017. We're going to do our Angel Shemuel channeling for this month. So thank you all again for watching. Namaste and we'll jump right in. Dearest children of Eve, those who have been with me since the beginning of man, why do you weep? Why do you worry? When love rides on your back, everywhere you go. Always listen with the heart, see with the heart, speak with the heart. Allow yourself to be moved internally by the love and the heart center. Allow yourself to progress on the path with that loving kindness pressing you forward urging you into far greater, more refined versions of self. Remember that everything that happens to you in your life only serves to increase the capacity for you to acknowledge and to embody love. When you feel the pressure of spirit weighing down on you, and it seems to weigh heavy on the heart. Allow the heart to break open, let it spill forth, let it expand throughout your whole being. Let it even spill onto the earth and guide every step that you take. In the end, all of the darkness and all of the light is all from the same heart. Ebbing and flowing like waves rolling up onto the shore and then backing away again. As the yin falls to the yang and the yang falls to the yin, we find ourselves in this tumultuous drama of life, crashing from one shore to another shore, feeling the ebb and flow in between and we get so caught up in the transition and the change that we forget the heart that unites us all. So when you forget, remember. Remember to hear, to feel, to see, to be moved by, to reach out with, to pull in with, to ground down and lift up with a spirit of love. Allow yourself to pause. Acknowledge where the physical heart is. Can you feel it moving, beating, pressing blood from one chamber to another? Maybe you can feel the blood moving out of the arteries throughout the body. Do you feel pulses in your joints? Pressing your thumbs together, can you feel the pulse of life moving through a heart center? Acknowledge the physical heart. Take a deep breath in and out and feel the wind that animates the movement of love. And see if you can remember what love feels like, even just for a moment. Not always a grandiose idea sometimes just a simple appreciation for what is. The love of a texture. The love of an emotion. The love of an occurrence, a wish, a dream. 
if you can remember this feeling of love, you allow that to be a bridge. So breathe through that feeling, breathe it through the body, and just imagine it moving out of the body, up through the crown, out through the feet, expanding out from heart center, from navel, from the base of the spine. Imagining all of the heart love expanding throughout the environment in which you're in, through all boundaries, whether furniture or plants. Allow it to move through easily, quickly, efficiently, completely expanding and enlightening all things. And when you've expanded it, as outwardly as possible from the inner eye to the external world. Then gently open your eyes in this place and view all things in love. Whatever tumultuous attitude you may be feeling flushing through your being, whatever pain and suffering that you might be going through, the losses and the gains. See if you can simply be in love with it. Expand the light into every situation, to every moment. And while you're going through the hard work of earthly life. If you recognize the love that you carry, then all will recognize the love within. In loving kindness, with my whole heart, I extend to you my warmest, my deepest respect admiration and love. Namaste, my dearest children.